What's up guys and welcome back to LEGO Worlds and as you can see I've been messing around with building because that's what we're going to be focusing on mostly for today is going to be the building parts of LEGO Worlds because you know it's it's always nice and fun to do. I wanted to go off this way too. I think this flatland area might be a great place to start building if we get rid of some trees and I have some cool things in mind. Oh, I don't need this. I did also want to let you guys know that when I was running around um, between episodes I did actually find a new character that I didn't want to pass up on because I've never seen him before. It was the robber, the man. He's like, I'm so mean, and I've never seen him before, so I didn't want to give up the chance of, fun, you know, you know, getting him, and maybe that would be the last time I ever saw him. So with that being said, let us um go for this way. I feel like there's gonna be something cool over here, but either way, we're just gonna scope out this area, see what's going on over here. Ooh, whoa, what is that? It's like a little Chinese building. I've never seen that before. All right, then we already have stuff to check out. Then cool stuff. Things are starting off well. Um, let's uh, get all this stuff out of the way though, and then we'll just hop out of this plane. Wow, this is really cool, King. I've never seen this. Like we've been to this biome before, but we I don't think we ever did it in like a big size. So maybe this will have some cool stuff in it. I mean, it's really tall, so there should be some cool stuff in it. I I think I'd hope, but there are some chests up here in the lower areas. Um, what is over here? And uh, not much of anything. Hmm. Maybe I can climb from the outside, ooh, 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 or I can just walk around like a maniac. <laughs> come on, Mr. Robber. I know that you rob things for a living, but <laughs> you don't have to go ninja on me. Come on, come on, come on. Yep, 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 sneak out of here. And then, uh, oh boy. Uh, yeah, how are we supposed to do it? The camera won't work with me. Um, yeah, I don't know if there's like anything inside this. I feel like we should bring out the, the uh, tools soon to find out, but I want to climb to the very, very top. Maybe I should just uh, <laughs> use a machine or, or some sort, but. We'll, do, we'll do, just skill it out like this, and now we're at the top. Hmm. I don't see too much, which is sort of disappointing. Oh, that's a really cool ice biome out there, but like, hey, stay on topic, Zebra. Stay on topic. Let's um try building um, really quickly. Uh, where would we do that? Um, remove terrain. And then let's just see what we can find in this. Like, is there anything in here? I'm not really sure. It would be weird if there was no actual entrance. Oh, I do see stuff down there. All right, then, let's... um. Yeah, get out of here really quick and see. I do see a chest in there. I think, ah, darn it, I'm falling. <laughs> okay, so I see it. I see it down here, is it? I saw it for sure, though. So maybe it's just somewhere around this area. Hmm, maybe it's down there. I'm not sure. Like, why wouldn't they give us a door or something similar to work with? Maybe there is, and I'm just missing it. But either way, it's pretty cool. Hmm. Oop, we're back close to the ground again, so. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, wait, here's a little hidden entrance. Okay, then maybe it's in here. Oh, there is a ladder in this one. Okay, we're making some progress, guys. We have found it, the hidden lair of the... <laughs> oh, wait, this ladder doesn't lead anywhere. I think this might have been spawned wrong. I think there might be, like, two spawned within each other. There's just some crazy weird stuff going on with this one. Um, hmm. Let's uh, try this. And I want to try to get to it without destroying it, of course, but that might be easier said than done at this point because it's just disappeared completely. Maybe I already destroyed it. That would be horrible. Um, oh no. Oh no, indeed. <laughs> Looking through at the moment, I can't see it anymore. I swear I thought I saw something when we were digging through, but maybe I accidentally destroyed it, which would be a bummer. But at the same time, I think this was spawned weirdly or wrong. So maybe sometime in the future we'll find a new one of these, and we'll actually have even more goodies and some cool stuff to find in there. But either way, now what I want to build in today's episode is I wanted to build a motorcycle track. We found the motorcycle a few episodes ago and I just sort of popped in my idea. I really like, <laughs> it's something I was really into when I was a kid was motorcycle tracks and that kind of stuff, you know, motocross and stuff. So I figured it would be pretty cool to try my, sh give a good shot at trying to build something like that. The first thing we're gonna have to do is to build a flat area. So we just need to go, I'm just probably gonna start it nice and straight like this. And then after a while we will also start, you know, forming the hills and stuff afterwards and like cool jumps and all that kind of stuff. But first we just need a straight runway so that we know where we're going and all that kind of cool stuff. We can have some of the trees in the way, it doesn't matter, well not in the way, but by the side so that there are some cool aesthetics. <laughs> by the way, this should be cool. I'll flatten out these trees so it doesn't look funky. But, and get this, <laughs> diffuses to get this one piece of the tree, there it goes. Okay, so we're just gonna keep going through here. Can we get rid of the skeletons this way? Nope, they still stay in the way. But I think it'll be really cool to make a little motorcycle track like this. We'll just make a few cool jumps with it and everything and see how it turns out. This should be long enough for now. Yeah, that's a nice long straightaway. So we're just gonna make it a straightaway. Have you ever played Excite Bike on the Nintendo Entertainment System? That's sort of the idea I'm getting here. I feel like it would be really cool to give something like that a shot. No, not what I wanted. Undo, uh, why won't it undo? Oh no. <laughs> okay, maybe this is where we can make our first jump. I want to, you know, make it a bit of a ramp. So let's see what we can do to make. This is smoothing. So what will happen if I do this? 
Uh, nothing. Nothing happens here. Uh, oh, there it goes. Okay, see, there, there it's a bit smooth. So, how can we raise ground? Maybe I can just add terrain and then smooth it out with the smoother. We just need to bring this guy up here and just keep this up so we know what we're doing. So we can um draw a line, L shift and hold. Uh, I'm not sure if that's what I want to do. Huh? Hmm. This is really weird. Um, do that a bit. Yeah, just like this. And oh, maybe that's a little too much. Why won't it ever undo it? That's the weird thing. It's like I'm trying so hard to get this to work, but it won't let me. Um, let's try then um, going with the smoother, which is gonna be this guy, and then just giving this a shot, and we just smooth it out, and then we'll try riding the motorcycle off of this to get make a sweet jump. <laughs> All right, that sounds like it'll be fun and cool. So we're gonna go over here to our machines and vehicles and stuff and pull out the motorcycle. We'll try it with the bicycle too, but for now, whoa, 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 what's that noise? Uh, I hear somebody trying to attack me or something, but I, that doesn't matter right now. We got oh, that might be a little too steep. <laughs> Only one way to find out. Ah, yeah, that's a little too steep. All right, then we'll keep working on this then. Um, hmm. What then we want to do then? We want to uh, go over the smoother again, and let's see what else we can do. We can change the tool shape. I don't really need to do that. Hmm. And like undoing doesn't do anything, which is a major bummer. I think that that might be broken because I remember that originally working. So let's just try to smooth it out a little more. The best way to do that would just make the jump longer. But yeah, I used to race bikes a lot when I was a kid. It was like this formed BMX thing where we'd race on dirt tracks with you know pedal bikes, not motorcycles. But it was so like a big part of my childhood. So it's always cool to look back on that kind of stuff. And this this was sort of an homage to that because a lot of people you know build Legos Legos in their childhood, and I did this sort of the same. So. Oh man, this jump is still really, really tall, so let's just try to thin it out a bit. Hmm. So we can change the cursor size by pressing Q and E, but it's already at its largest size. So, this tool's a little interestingly weird to use, because like that's not smoothing it out. I mean, I guess it is. Let's try, hmm, like lower terrain or raised terrain. Let's try raising it here and just raising it all like this. Or do like a bit of this. <laughs> it's a little tough, like terrain generation is really tough to figure out in this game. But we wanna try to get like a sick jump going on, like that's what I really wanna see. So let's give this a shot, I'm gonna keep messing with it. All right, let's simply just go for this jump. Oh, whoa, the polar bear got in my way. Uh, oh, the momentum with the motorcycle is a little weird, so it just doesn't really work right. Oh no, come on. Uh, the jumps, it, yeah, just doesn't take it fast enough. Let's try it with the normal bike and see what happens. But that's what I want to just do, is little little challenges and tasks like this to build stuff and just see how it works. And this is the way we're gonna learn how you know things work. This bike <laughs> isn't too fast, so I don't think it's gonna, ah! Extreme sports. Let's try something faster then. Um, This car is really fast, but it doesn't get over hills r well. So let's see what it will do here. And this is what I just wanna do, keep experimenting with the vehicles. If you guys have any type of cool challenges or difficult things to build or anything you wanna see built, just feel free to let me know. I just wanted to get started with this, sort of to get used to terrain generation, but uh, ah, things just don't take hills right, well, I broke my motorcycle a bit there. But things don't take too, hills too well in this game, which hopefully is something that has improved. Like the buggy, which is made to take hills and stuff, you know, that's sort of the point of the vehicle, will hopefully do a bit better. Let's see, if we get enough speed, you'd think so. So let's go. Ready? Uh, oh, sort of, sort of. <laughs> okay. Well, we, we're sort of getting. <laughs> I just got the, the the death pit of vehicles here, <laughs> the no go zone. All right then. So that's that. <laughs> we tried. We tried. That's the best we can do. So let's check out this area over here. This is another snow biome with a plane waiting for us. Pretty cool. More uh, snow people. I don't think there's actually too much we need to do here. I know when it comes to animals we need to find, if we check it out here, we need to find the brown cow and we also need to find the brown bull. Those can be found anywhere. So to really find those, we just go out and fly. Um, when it comes to other things, I know we need the black horse, which can be found by bandits. So I think one thing that we will do then is we need to um, go off and go to a desert biome where we'll actually find bandits along with cowboys. Cause you know like how a cowboy, it can spawn in a white horse at any point in time. Well, bandits can do that too. Oh, look, a satellite. That's cool. Hey, let's uh, get that really quick. I definitely don't have that in my um, roster of things. Oh, or maybe I. Oh, there, there I go. For a second, I was like, no, you do have it. And I was like, never mind. <laughs> All right, then. Then here's this spooky biome. One thing for the creatures is that you can be become a bat. Whoa, that's cool. The lava is clashing with the snow and even underwater. 
<laughs> There's so many cool little instances like that in this game. All right, so I don't think this is, yeah, this is definitely not the biome, the uh, spooky biome we were at before. <gasps> a vampire! I was just talking about you, you come over here right now, and uh, I'm gonna beat you up. The bandit will get you! Wah, 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 come on, get him, get him, get him, we gotta kill him. You gotta, yes! Finally, the vampire! <laughs> awesome, okay, we've been looking so hard for that guy, so let's give him a shot right now. Um, Vampire, and then, where is he? 10,000 is worth the pricing, and we have over 100,000, whoa. What am I doing? Uh, I wanna, I wanna, what? I can't play as him? Oh, there you go. And then I can turn into a bat now. Ha ha, I'm a bat. Wah <laughs> That is so cool, give me. I'm a bat flying in the sky. And now I don't even need a vehicle ever again. I can just fly around as a bat forever. Well, who's that? That's another vampire. Okay, got people falling from the trees and everything. <laughs> this is so cool. Okay, this is making me happy. Let's see what else we can do then. I'm just fly I just love flying around as a bat, it's the cutest thing. Ah, head dive. <laughs> Ouch, my bat head. Oh boy, hello mister. Can I fight you as a bat? Oh yes, I can. <laughs> Fear the bat. I'll give you a disease or something if I bite you, be careful. <laughs> okay then, whoa, he's chasing me. You can't chase a bat, buddy. Why can't I fly anymore? There I go. What's in, oh boy. I wanna see what it looks like when I open like a chest or something with a bat. So let's go in here really quick and see. Is this a uh, big chest? Oh no, it's a small chest, unfortunately. I wanna find an item chest and try to uh, open it up with that. Uh, it doesn't really work. Let's switch back to the vampire then. Uh, it won't let me. I'm stuck as a bat forever. I've waited too long. Okay, here, let's try it as this guy then. I definitely wanna get the chest and if it won't work as a bat, I'll try it with somebody else. It won't let me in there, it was sort of stuck. So, hmm, let's try it like this. Now I can get in there, yeah, I guess the bat just isn't allowed. Oh well, <laughs> they're discriminatory against bats. Why, well, what is with that? All right then, so we still need to find a desert, and we might find every, whoa, was that a zombie? That was a werewolf, no, ugh, the werewolves and zombies, it looks sort of similar, don't they? <laughs> uh, so that's the last guy we need to find in this area, is the zombie. Besides that, there are a lot of people we need to find, like the bandit, or not the bandit, like, I, we already have a bandit unlocked, but there's like another, like, outlaw, that's what it is. There's an outlaw we need to find. And, oh no, ow! <laughs> Didn't even see it, whoops. It's okay, we can actually earn those bolts back, because there's a chest over here, and there's, there have been so many chests popping up too, which is crazy. Oh, there's two of them, cool. All right, then get this and get that. Get all this stuff, another horse. We have all the horses we need, <laughs> except for the black one, of course. All right, then. So finally, I think it's t about time that we pull up a vehicle again and give it a shot. I did read online that the small submarine does not dive currently. Hopefully soon it does, because that would be a cool addition. They have not released any actual updates to the game yet as of this video recording, which should go up today. I don't know. <laughs> you let me know. Are you watching this right now? I would think so, but um, uh, yeah, there is not an update out currently. I always make sure to check every day. Is that Stonehenge? Oh man, we found a, na is that a naturally spawning Stonehenge? That is really cool. I've never found a naturally st spawning Stonehenge before because we've found a Stonehenge by spawning it in ourselves, but, oh, oh, oh no, 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 what has happened Stonehenge? Why would you do this to me? Uh-oh, uh-oh, we're breaking, we're breaking the game, we're falling, and I died. Okay, that was crazy weird. My game did not like that. No, oh, I'm back in the plane. <laughs> Go get back over here and get this chest. There we go. All right then. So we've got a crazy adventure going on right now, guys. This has been really cool. We've been building race tracks. We have been falling through the map, and we have been getting vampires. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like and share with your friends and family. And comment in the comment section below. If you've watched at this point in the video, make sure to comment falling through the map so that I know you've watched at this point in the video and that you're a zebra tastic viewer. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.